All right, monsoon on a little bit of a break here, especially across the northern third of the state. 80 degrees our high temperature today in Flagstaff, 5 degrees above the average for this time of year overnight last night. Pretty close to average here with our temperatures now getting down into the mid 40s. Really haven't had any significant rain around here all work week, but we're still well above average for this time of year, nearly four inches above average. At one time, we were about five inches above average, and it uh, looks like we're going to be dry around here for a couple more days. More on that in a second. Temperatures across the state today, very hot across the northern portion of the state where it was mostly sunny, 96 in Page, 96 in Kingman, but then down in Sedona and the southern half of the state where we saw a little bit more cloud cover, not quite as hot out there, not maybe even a couple degrees below average. Sedona, 91, only 11 degrees above Flagstaff, where you're usually around 15 degrees warmer. Flag Prescott, usually around 10 degrees warmer than Flagstaff, but only 85, only 93 down in Phoenix today. So that tells me there's something going on, and sure enough, it's all this cloud cover that we see mainly for the southern half of the state, mainly sunny skies across the northern half of the state. And this is all remnant moisture from what is no longer a hurricane. Tropical Depression Linda is a post-tropical storm right now. We're going to talk about that in a second. A little bit of thunderstorm activity just making its way into the lower Colorado River Valley area, and uh, we'll see some of that continue in Mojave County, I think, through the evening hours. Alright, let's zoom it out a little bit and talk about Linda. Remember a couple days ago it was a hurricane even off the spur of Baja, California. Yesterday it was a tropical storm today, a tropical depression today, no longer tropical in nature. It's just a bunch of nothing, just a bunch of moisture down there hanging out. And it's trying to make its way in, but it's battling dry air coming in from the north that's suppressing it off to the south. That's why it looks like it's going to stay around here tomorrow. And again on Saturday, I think statewide dry air winds out with dry and warm conditions. And then as we get into Sunday, Monday, it looks like the storm track that we see moving into the center portion of the country kind of backs a little bit. We get a trough of low pressure moving through the west, and models are indicating that's going to pull in some of this moisture, and we get into an active type monsoon pattern late Sunday into early next week. Currently outside, 68 degrees, partly cloudy, dew point 51 degrees, and overnight tonight, I think we Gradually clear the skies out by the time we're in tomorrow morning. We're sunny 46 for an early morning low, same as we were last night. Tomorrow, a little bit more sunshine for us in Flagstaff. I'll call it mostly sunny throughout the day, 80 degrees with uh, almost zero chances of showers and thunderstorms. And low chances south of the Mogollon Rim out there tomorrow. 95 for you in Sedona, 88 pace and 89 in Prescott up in Tuba City. Your Friday, 87 degrees. All right, extended forecast for us here, right around 80, dry through Saturday. I bring in a chance to showers and thunderstorms storms and it looks like it could turn out to be an active and wet situation setting up late Sunday into early next week. We can certainly use the rain here as we're on the tail end of the monsoon.